Hey everybody, Radu here and in this video I'm going to show you how easy it is to create a list with MailX. So all I have to do is click on the lists button in the left menu right here and it sends me to this list right here. Now all I have to do is create new, it's the button right here and then I have to set up this list. Now the name is something that you want to put on the list so you know where it's coming from so for instance i can put free bonus and i know that these subscribers come from the free bonus section on my site now this display name is used in subscription forms and template tags and so on and you only have to fill it if you want it to be different from this one so i don't so i'm gonna let just let free bonus now the description is for your subscribers, so something like you're, you're on this list because you downloaded my free bonus. Now you have to select between opting, opting in and opting out and whether or not that subscriber should receive a welcome email. Now on opt-in, single opt-in means that once they subscribe they are automatically added to your list and double opt-in means that they actually receive an email first asking them are you sure you want to subscribe and they, 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 they need to confirm that. So single opt-in gets you the most subscribers, double opt-in makes sure that they verify their emails before getting whatever they, they get from you. Okay, and the same applies to opting out. Now notifications, if you want to receive notifications to whatever email you want to, whenever a subscriber uh, gets added to your list or unsubscribed, you can do that here. And then uh, these are the your name, email and reply to that your subscribers should see, as well as a default subject if you want to add that and have it uh, for all your campaigns. Now this is for your company details and it's pretty straightforward and it's required by the Can Spam Act, so you have to complete this. And once everything is done, you click save changes, your list is finished and you can import and start using it. Okay, that's it. Thank you for watching and I'll see you in the next one.